Use this oil three to four times a week to improve the thickness of your hair. Be consistent with the use of the oil to get rid of the thin edges. Ball spa, if you struggle with dryness, itchy scalp, this is the oil for you. Hey families, welcome back to my channel. My name is Linda. If this is your first time here, welcome to my channel. So on this channel, I do a lot of DIY videos for natural hair, perm hair, all type of hair. So with that being said, I have another DIY video for you guys today. So in today's video, we're going to be using hibiscus and clove to make our hair growth oil. I love, love, love these two combinations. Hibiscus has been my favorite for a very, very long time. I love hibiscus. Hibiscus a hair growth from dormant hair follicles, helping cover both patches and also combat dryness and dandruff as well. You can use it two or three times a week to provide deep nourishment and improve blood circulation on your hair. The measurement I'll be using today is going to be one eighth cup. So I'm Going to be using two of the 1 8 cup of hibiscus and one 1 8 cup of clove. Frequent use of hibiscus help reduce hair fall, it stimulates hair regrowth, and prevents premature growing of hair. You can include hibiscus in your mask, hair mask, shampoo, conditioner, in your hair care routine. While hibiscus comes in many different colors, the red one is the best one to use. And the oil I'll be using is going to be olive oil. I'll be using three of the 1 8th cup. I'm gonna add it to the hibiscus and the clove in the blender and I'm gonna go ahead and blend them together. Clove as we all know it is very very powerful when it comes to making your hair thick. Clove has literally changed my natural hair journey honestly and I know it did for a lot of you guys. Clove contains high levels of antioxidant and nutrient that can add to the growth and the strength of our hair. Clove can be used for protecting the scar from danger, which is usually a major cause of weak and thin hair. Clove also contains anti-inflammatory agent, which further help in hair thickening, like I was saying before. It helps to reduce hair fall as well. With the presence of vitamin K in cloves, there's a better blood circulation, which stimulates hair to grow. And because of the antioxidant in clove, it helps uh, prevent premature growing of hair. So if you have hair for hair thinning ball spot like clove is your friend include clove or even hibiscus in your um hair regimen and you see, see like a major 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 uh change in your hair growth so the oil is ready i just let it sit and cool off a little bit i'm gonna go ahead and add a safflower oil organic cold press one i'm gonna go ahead and add one eighth cup to the clove and the hibiscus um oil I love, 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 love this um, safflower oil. It just like when I have itchiness on my scalp, it just stops it. That's why I'm trying to add it to my oil. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm going to go ahead and add one eighth cup of Jamaican black castor oil as well. Love, 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 love this stuff. It keeps my hair very, very moisturized for a very, very long time, you guys. It gives me that shine that I'm looking for. You guys do not sleep on it. It's like $3 or $2 at your local beauty supply. Run and go, go get yourself one i'm gonna go ahead and add a uh, peppermint oil now um probably about 10 drops i just love the smell of peppermint oil and it treats your scalp if you have itchy scalp or dry scalp um trying to use peppermint oil add it to your oils or your shampoo or whatever and then you should be good to go i'm gonna add about 10 drops and then i'm gonna go ahead and add my black rice um the powerful growth i love 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 this ingredient um, I got it from my local beauty supply. It's all natural and it still have the black rice sitting under. It's very, very good for your scalp. It treats your scalp. It deep conditions your hair. I'm in love with it. I bought two of them. I have the mint one. Um, this one is very, very good. It nourishes your hair. It nourishes your scalp as it sit on it. It does exactly that. I'm going to go ahead and add about maybe uh, five drops to the oil. And then I'm going to go ahead and add about 10 drops of my um, Edge um, Dope Oil Growth to, um, to the oil as well. This is very, very good. If your edges are thinning or you just give birth and you're struggling with your edges, I recommend you using that oil. Um, just You can use it by itself. Um, I got it from my local beauty supply. They have it at um, Amazon as well. You can grab yours at Amazon. I'm going to go ahead and add about 10 drops um, to it as well. And I'm going to go ahead and grab my bottle and transfer my oil into my bottle. Any bottle that you have is perfectly fine. Anything that you can 
can use the oil out of it is fine just transfer the oil in there i didn't you guys notice i did not take this oil to the stove it's just something new that i'm trying to see the difference between when the oil sits on the stove and when the oil is natural like no manipulation at all and i'll definitely let you guys know on um, what i feel about it but here we have it the oil is ready to be used my hair is freshly washed and i'm gonna go ahead and just apply the oil into my hair so i have not used hibiscus in my hair for about like a year so what i did is i used this oil for three weeks to see how it's gonna my hair's gonna like it or before i bring it to you guys and i love it love it love it love it love it guys i love it it deep conditions my hair like no itchy scalp nothing whatsoever so i'm gonna go ahead and apply it in my hair my scalp especially massaging your scalp with the oil that we make is what literally produce the new hair growth we need that blood circulation to push uh, forth the new hair growth so make sure that you massage your scalp very very well with this oil so that's what i'm doing right now i'm gonna apply it to my edges um everywhere in my hair and then i'm gonna start um unraveling my hair and applying it to the tip of my hair from the from the root to the tip of my hair so that's what I'm doing here right now. So after I apply the oil in my hair, I comb through my hair very, very well to make sure the oil um it's everywhere in the hair every four core of the hair receives this oil so that's what i did throughout the whole entire hair you guys but this is a i uh, love you guys so much thank you so much for the support for the love you guys are showing me um i'll see you guys again in my next video um please let me know under the comment section will you guys use this have you used it before have you used have you used either like a clove or the hibiscus oil how did it treat your hair and don't forget to subscribe like and share this video with family and friends you guys thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you so much i'll see you guys again in my next video until next time take care bye bye